so I'm gonna be fishing today. Um, I I managed to do most of the quests, which um, I've been following this guide on the forums. Let me show you it real quick. So right here, I mean, if you want to check out this guide, this basically explains like everything you need to know for getting started. Um, so starting from crafting your pole and everything, which uh, I'll show you the place where I picked it up in this zone, which I'll go I'll go visit it because I have to go back over there to go like turn in the quest. Actually, no, I don't think it's not like what. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, because he's like over here on this side in the main city. So yeah, I'll, I'll show you exactly where he is. But um, um, right now I'm doing the the herrings and the squid, which I already collected the squid and I collected it in uh, Aegeus Island. But um, in this guide, um, it's telling me to go to. Let me see. So for the herring, the Carkis Ridgelands. It's probably a better chance at dropping. The peace zones I noticed don't really have the best drop rates. I think it has to do with like if you go to an active PvP zone, you have a better chance. That's what I'm noticing at least. I've actually been doing pretty decent with um, money ever since I started fishing. Pretty much like you spend all this money on bait, but you start getting all your money back. So you don't really have to worry too much because you're going to be fishing your ass off. Like you're going to be sitting there like fishing, fishing, fishing. So. As you're doing that, you're collecting all these like random bullshit fish that people actually want to buy because they're trying to like craft, you know, so it, it really helps to get your money back after you spent that initial investment. So let me see what's sold. I only failed one bid. Okay, so that's good. Oh, and that was me just trying to bid on something. All right, that works. That works. All right, let me see how much money I made there. All right. I made about... Probably about 30, 30,000, I mean, 30 gold <laughs> to 30,000, I wish. I guess we'll go to the coast over here and, and go check it out. Um, right? I mean, yeah, subarctic, this whole zone is. All right, let's go over there. You could pretty much fish wherever. I've never seen, like, a problem with just fishing wherever you want. I mean, you could just fish from a dock or something to make it easier, but... Like, I like the scenery of actually going to a place where, you know, fishing would be a thing. You know what I mean? Like, actually coming out and coming to a place where you think fishing would happen. Oh, there's a player over there. Look at that. I'll leave him alone. I'm not gonna fuck with him. Because I can kill lobies very easily. <laughs> I can kill lobies very easily, but whenever I fight an actual, like geared player forget it like i can't do shit so useless i did fix up my build though a little bit i <clears throat> boosted my damage so i went more with um agility and i finally got that that scale thing so i was able to like get rid of the problem i was having with like not being able to fucking kill shit fast enough so now i'm actually able to kill things pretty decently fast it's just the only downside though oh look at that a herring right away look at that i got a herring right away Wow, I got another one. Holy fuck. It's super easy to get herring here. Damn. And those herrings are worth a lot of money on the auction house. Like, look. Look, I got three of them already. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep fishing here if that's the thing. Cause, Cause look, let me show you how much herring are worth. Watch this shit. Look. 369 right now. Like I, I think I'm gonna hang out here for a little bit because that, that was too fast. There goes another herring. I'm gonna collect at least like 10 of them. Look at that shit. All right, no, we're staying here for a bit. We're chilling. Look up herring. Yeah, you see, there's only one person posted. So basically, I can I can undercut the shit out of this guy and I'll still make a shit ton of gold. See, cause look, they're they're fucking. This guy's trying to like crack dealer price everybody, because they normally used to go for about twelve silver. You see that? They were selling a lot for nine. You see, so they were like averaging. They were averaging like twelve and nine, and then over here, crack dealer time was when I guess you know the beginning of the month when people were still trying to get their quest done. You know, so probably after this one. We're, we might get started on actual sport fishing, which, oh yeah, I forgot. I got those boots, I think. Oh no, this is the mission that gives me the boots. 
So once I turn this in, it gives me boots that increase my profici uh, proficiency in fishing. I'm trying to speak too fast. If you know anything about the fishing with a group, like a you know fishing raid or whatever, if I was to put my fish in the boat, I mean, could somebody technically steal my fish and, and turn it in, and then you know, is that a thing? Like I, I don't I don't understand like how that would be. Like I feel like somebody could just steal your fish. I could say, oh, I, I had uh, three fish, but really I only fished one. All right, there we go. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, look at this. Oh shit. Fucking crash it into the goddamn thing. So this is uh, Fisherman Rico right here. He just gave me the boots. So this um, this uh, gives you proficiency. So now the next mission, he gives you the lures. There it is. So this is the sports fishing lures. Um, are they trying to... F oh shit, he got fucking... Okay, he's, he's trying to turn in his fish, you see? Look, look, look. Oh, I hope you survive. <laughs> like, he almost died, man. That guard fucked, like, 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 fucked over the other dude. See, but he turned in his fish, so... He probably made about 13 gold-ish for turning in the fish. So, he's turning in more fish. Oh, they got a bunch of fish down there. So, so this is the spot anyway. So, Fisherman Rico. I'm not sure if there's a, a Nuian version of this. I'm in Haran I'm in a Haranian. So... You come down to Yenistir and you go to this place. This is the the Cernoid, and uh, he's right here. So you can come check him out. He'll give you the first quest for the fishing. I don't know. Whoa! Somebody died. These guys are like thirsty. The fucking PVP right now. Like, look, these guys are like trying to steal fish. I guess. Uh, let them have their fucking fish. Bunch of assholes. God damn. Collect surgeon fry trophy. All right, where do we do this? You need to catch a surgeon and turn it in into a trophy. Do not turn in it in for money. You're turning it in for a separate trophy option. But I need chum. Oh yeah, I need chum. Like, which I have the chum bucket. But I saw there's actually a really good guide also on YouTube. Um, I forgot his name, but um, he was mentioning that there was this this place with like a pond that you don't need chum buckets and you can actually fish off of there it's like pre-chummed basically it's like in a peace zone oh it's this one it's this one i think with the the lily pads and shit let's go over there i'm not gonna waste my proficiency like oh my god i want to farm all these things right now oh my god no Stop it. <laughs> Shit. I need my labor, goddammit. See, there's an actual fishing thingamajiggy on it. So supposedly this is already pre-chummed, so you can basically just fish. Oh, look, there's a bunch of people fishing here. See? Not alone on this. So basically, sell a sport fish or craft a sport fish into a the core item. Maybe that's what the trophy is. Um, this effect is equipment. It can be reactivated. Do you want to react? Reactivate the effect. All right, let's put it on. There, I put the lure on it. It's available for two hours. All right, so now we can do sports fishing. Oh shit! Here we go. All right, let's give it a shot. So now it's supposed to be like a mini game, like you basically play Dance Dance Revolution and you're supposed to catch the fish with a Dance Dance Revolution thing. So reveal or reel in the fish when it jumps. So as it jumps up, you got to reel it in. This one reel in the fish as it dives. This is the left and the right. And then what's this one? Loosen the reel so it doesn't break. I'm also curious as to how much labor it costs for you to do this. Oh, a pink putter fish. Okay, what are we what are we supposed to do? Okay. Okay, I'm doing the side thing. Am I supposed to keep clicking it? Okay, let it go. There we go. All right, dance, dance, revolution. If it's slack, what else do you need me to do? Pull that shit. Oh no. Okay, that was bad. Okay, what's happening? Oh, okay, this. 
Okay, let it go. All right, what's okay? Oh, oh, it's diving. Oh, it's going up. I'm doing some damage. Holy shit, he's like all over the place. This thing. All right, we got that. You just gotta click it once. <laughs> the music that's playing is funny. There we go. I'm doing some damage. Going down. Got you, motherfucker. Give it slack. Where are you going now? Like, you went underneath the thing now. I would have lost this line by now. Shit. In real life? Would have been done. GG line. He's going down. Got him. Alright, he's dead. Alright, not, not, what are you... I think he's supposed to grab him now. Yeah, there he is. Oh my god, it's dark down here. Got him. Got the fish. If I could find the freaking... Surface. Holy shit, it's dark. So sell a sport fish or the core item? I guess we sell it because that's not the fish that we wanted. Ooh, we get three gold for it. Three gold, 40 set, uh, 43 silver. It costs 50 labor. Hey, that's fucking good. Right? I mean, I'm trying to think about it. Like, if I would have opened up a coin purse, it would have been one gold for, like, 30 or 25 or something. So, yeah, I think that's actually pretty worth it. I don't know. Whatever. This is more fun than opening coin purses, I'll tell you that much.